Hey guys, Tay your hair and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, welcome. If you already been here, thanks for coming back. So today's video is going to be a fun one. I am going to be sharing to you guys my top 10 favorite body butters and body lotions. I am going to give you guys options at different price points. I'm going to show you some of my favorites if you are looking for something to layer your fragrances, if you are looking for something for everyday wear, if you are looking for something to treat hyperpigmentation or just to give you hydration, I have something for you. So if you are interested in seeing my favorites then please keep on watching before we start the video please make sure you are subscribed to the channel please turn your post notifications on so you get notified every time your girl uploads a video and follow me on instagram and with that being said let's jump right into the video all right you guys before i start this video let me just say everything that i mentioned in this video i will have linked down below for you guys and as always feel free to leave your recommendations in the comment section down below because if i'm being honest you guys put me on to a lot of great products some of the body creams that i'm going to mention in this video you guys put me on to so feel free to leave your recommendations down below i might not mention your favorites but chances are i probably haven't discovered it as yet so go ahead and leave them down below firstly i'm going to start with the obvious one of my favorites in my collection a staple in my routine a body butter that i've repurchased time and time again and this is the fenty butter drop body butter I love this so much before the limited edition since i was using the original body butter it is absolutely amazing if you have extremely dry skin and you want a body butter that is going to hydrate your skin it's not going to just sit on top of your skin your skin is going to soak it up it's going to give you a really nice glow without being greasy the Fenty body butter. I've repurchased this body butter so much. It is more pricey, but it is 100% worth it. You just have to try it. And once you try it, trust me, you will not go back. If you have extremely dry skin, you are really going to love this. It is perfect for all year round. Every now and then Fenty will have some really good sales and I'm able to like stock up on my refills. So I always have a backup of this. And these two scents are limited edition scents. The one in the pink jar is a vanilla scent and this one is a cinnamon scent. Sometimes they come back in stock on Sephora or on the Fenty website. If you pay attention to my community tab, I'll let you guys know when I see them back in stock. But both of these smell absolutely amazing. They have shimmers in it. If you want something to layer your fragrances, you are going to love these as well. But the original is just a staple in my routine. This is just a bonus for me. The formula of the Fenty Body Butters is 100 out of 10 for me. If you're looking for a good body butter, Fenty skin. The next one that I have is from Laura Mercier. This one is also a little bit pricey, but is worth it. This is very moisturizing, very hydrating. This body butter, you can apply this onto your skin and not wear any perfume and still smell really good. I have three scents. I believe they have four scents, but off the four, I have three. First one is almond coconut. The next one is amber vanille. And I also have creme brulee. This smells like a true creme brulee. This smells like a really nice ambery vanilla scent. And then this one is just almond and coconut perfect to layer with your coconut fragrances but this isn't just another pricey body butter it is very moisturizing very nourishing on the skin as i said they linger on the skin so perfect for layering i believe laura Mercier is changing the packaging for her body butters so it's currently on sale so now is the perfect time to pick it up if you want to try them out i hope that with the change of the packaging they don't change the formula so i'll have that linked down below honestly it took me years to try this body butter i picked one up tried it i fell in of and i ended up with three off the four so if you're looking for a really good body butter try this one from laura mercier it's absolutely amazing if you've tried it let them know how good it is in the comment section down below being that i just talked about two pricey body butters i'm going to switch it up a bit and talk about something that is a little bit more affordable and this is from eos this is the 24 hour shea better body lotion this one is in the scent of vanilla cashmere i also have the scent coconut waters and the scent fresh and cozy if you have ten dollars and you're looking for a good body lotion this is it this is it right here they have tons of different scents i believe they even have like a raspberry scent it is very moisturizing without being heavy without being greasy without being sticky and as i said this body lotion is under ten dollars i believe it's 7.99 it is a beautiful body lotion i've been through multiples of the vanilla scent this one is my favorite if you love vanillas and you want a vanilla lotion that is going to go with everything vanilla based this is it and the thing that i love about this vanilla lotion it's that 
that it's not a synthetic kind of vanilla it smells very expensive it smells like an expensive body lotion it smells very rich very luxe so I love this and I've been through multiples of this I think my second favorite is the fresh and cozy this goes with literally everything clean this is my scent of the day today I did use this and I paired it with a bubble bath from replica just for a clean cozy fresh kind of scent and then this coconut water scent it goes with a lot of like my more summery scents so for example Kaoli Utopia cocoa this goes really well with it if you want something that is affordable but is going to get the job done try the EOS body lotions I talk about these time and time again and if you guys don't already own these you need to go ahead and pick them up I live in Canada they don't sell these in Canada and I go out of my way to order these from Target every time I use them up it's that good the next one that I have is another one that is very affordable this is from body by TPH this is the softer than a mother body butter this is in the scent of vanilla and tuberose if I'm being honest I would call this like a body balm instead of like a body butter because it is very 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 thick for me personally I think this one is a little bit too much for the summertime it is perfect for the winter time let me show you guys I used this up during the winter it is amazing I don't know how to explain it but if you're familiar with like coconut oil if you leave it to sit it kind of like hardens and you have to like break it down like warm it up in your hand to like break it down that's how this body butter is it gives me that kind of consistency it is very thick I honestly don't pair this with a body oil it does not need any help at all it is going to moisturize it's going to lock in everything and when you wake up in the morning your skin is going to feel so hydrated so supple so soft this it needs no help at all i love the tph body oil but usually when i'm using this i don't use anything else in comparison to my other body butters this one is a little bit more heavier on the skin so you will feel it on your skin because it's very thick so i like to apply this at least an hour and a half before i go into bed because i feel like it's going to rub off on the sheets like it's going to mess up my sheets but it's very very hydrating very 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 hydrating it's like a oil and a butter and a balm all in one it is really Really nice so if you need extreme hydration try this one out from TPH I don't remember the price for this one but I know that it is very affordable you can find this one in Walmart what I am going to do is I'm going to have the price pop up for each body butter as I talk about them but if you want something that is just really affordable try this one out the next one that I have is from Josie Marin this is the whipped argan oil body butter they have tons of different scents but my personal favorite is the scent vanilla bean I also smelled the scent vanilla apricot and I think I'm going to pick that one up this is like neck and neck with my Fenty if I should rate I'd say Fenty and then Josie Marin very hydrating very moisturizing if you have extremely dry skin this is another one that is really good it is going to give you a nice glow as well without looking greasy on your skin my skin loves this body butter I believe this is my second or my third jar of this body butter I have a few other scents but those scents are limited edition if you want to try this body butter hopefully this video goes out in time but I think it is on sale right now on Sephora so I will have it linked down below and I think all the scents are on sale you can get unscented vanilla apricot I believe there's a citrus scent as well tons of different scent the formula is absolutely amazing this formula is comparable to the one from Fenty. Fenty is just a tad bit more hydrating in my opinion but I love both of them. Both are staples in my routine. If you're looking to splurge on a body butter this is a really good one. The vanilla bean scent is also similar to the one from Fenty. Just a really nice soft vanilla scent that goes well with everything. This pairs well with literally anything that is vanilla based if you're looking for a good vanilla body butter. This one from Josie Myron is a 10 out of 10 for me. The next one that I have is another body lotion. This is from Hemp's. I have this one in the scent Koa and Sweet Almond. To me, this smells like vanilla and almond. It smells so good. A very lightweight body lotion. I'm not big on like body lotions because I think some body lotions, they don't keep you hydrated for long. I feel like I have to constantly reapply but not hems whenever i need something that is lightweight i reach for hems body lotion this is another 
brand that has so many scents it's hard to keep track of this is more on the pricier side but it depends on where you buy it if you're going to buy hemp's body lotion i highly recommend you check amazon you check marshall's tj maxx winners and you'll definitely find this at a discounted price they have tons of different scents this one smells absolutely amazing if you want something that is very lightweight on your body especially probably for the nighttime or if it's hot outside the hems formula is really really good very hydrating very nourishing but very 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 lightweight this is what i reach for when i want something that i cannot feel on my skin but i don't want to be ashy in like two hours this is a really nice body lotion so if you're looking for a good one check out hems by the way if you've tried hems before let me know your favorite hems scent in the comments section down below but my favorite is sweet koa and almond okay you guys i'm almost done i'm also going to give you guys some honorable mentions because it's hard to just do 10 but the next one that i have is from sol de janeiro if you don't know by now i'm a sol de janeiro stan i love the body butters this one is the scent beja flora this is chirosa 68 this is the og boom boom cream this is chirosa 62 and then this one is the bum dear bright this is chirosa 40 love them if you want something to layer with try the sol de janeiro me personally i like the formula i feel like the scents they linger on the skin you just have to work them into your skin they don't give you like a super glowy skin but at the end of the day my skin does not feel dry after using them if you want good body butters try the sol de janeiro i know the sol de janeiro body butters they have like weird claims but if i'm being honest i buy them because of the scent they don't leave my skin dry after using them it's not like fenty beauty level of hydration but my skin feels moisturized and the scents linger on my skin perfect for layering i love the formula of sol de janeiro body butters let me know your favorite scent in the comment section down below but of the three that i have i'd say my favorite is 62 40 and then 68 i love all of them i also tried the one in the green jar that was like my least favorite i feel like the formula of that one was a little bit sticky so i wasn't a fan if you want good body butters to layer with your fragrances try the ones from sol de janeiro I'm a stand and I will always purchase these. The next one that I have is another one that is perfect for extremely dry skin, perfect for winter time. I don't know if you can tell by now, I have extremely dry skin and some body lotions, you guys, I use them and then in like two hours I go outside and I come back and you'd think I didn't use body lotion. My skin is like that dry, especially during the winter time and this one is just perfect for winter this is the osea Undarian algae body butter if you love the osea body oil you are going to love this it smells the exact same way this is just a cream version to that this one is really thick but when i say thick i mean in a good way it is going to moisturize your skin my skin literally soaks this up it melts into your skin so easily you can apply this on dry skin or on damp skin and it still goes on really nicely it is perfect for winter time when you want that extra layer of moisture to withstand the cold this one depending on your skin type you can pull this off during the summertime for some people i feel like this is going to be a bit much during the summertime personally love this body butter if you prefer a butter over a oil try this one out i also love the matching body oil for this the two together hydration overload but on its own it is a great product as well the next one that i have is from hue this is the saint bart's body cream I'm not just talking about this body cream because it smells amazing but the formula of this body cream is actually really good when it comes on to a lot of higher end body creams and body lotions we kind of expect them to smell good but we don't expect like that good hydrating formula but way did not disappoint at all when i tell you this body cream is worth every penny it is worth every penny if i finish this tonight i'm going to repurchase it tomorrow it is that good it is very moisturizing but it smells like a tropical vacation they also have other scents if you're familiar with like melrose place they have a body cream for that so you can try those out as well but my personal favorite is the saint saint bart's it is absolutely amazing and it's worth every single penny if you want a body cream to layer with your fragrances that it's going to go perfectly with your more like tropical vacation scents this is the one it goes really nice with pakaraban fame goes really well with anything that is like juicy tropical 10 out of 10 and just a need for the summertime 
So before I jump into my honorable mentions, the final one that I have might ruffle a few feathers, but if I'm talking about body lotions and body creams, I have to include them in this video. And this is my Bath & Body Works body cream. If you want the cheapest body cream you can find, especially if you are into layering your fragrances, go to Bath & Body Works. All you need to do is pair them with a body oil. Depending on the scent, I like using my TPH body oil because I find that that body oil does not overpower the scent of the body creams from Bath & Body Works. They go perfectly together. My personal favorite scent is the scent Wrapped in Vanilla. I recently finished up a tube of this. I am on my second tube. The next one that I love is Fireside Flories. I have a backup of this. This is a dupe for Coffee Break from Replica. This is one of the longest lasting body creams from Bath & Body Works. I can apply this to my body wake up the next morning and still smell it on my skin it smells amazing the next one is fall in bloom this one goes well with Burberry her this one goes well with Burberry her elixir I have tons of other body creams from Bath & Body Works but I have to mention them in this video if you want something that is very affordable to layer your fragrances I know it's not like Fenty level of hydration but it's very hydrating and paired with the right body oil trust this will hold you down for hours. The semi-annual sale is coming up and products are usually 75% off. So honestly, it doesn't get cheaper than that. If you are into layering your fragrances, you can go to Bath & Body Works with $10 and come out with two, three body creams that is going to layer really nicely with your niche or your designer perfumes. And you save a lot of money. So I have to mention Bath & Body Works body creams. I love them and I will forever repurchase them. Might not buy the body mist as much, but the body creams and the body lotion lotions I will forever purchase these you cannot beat the price and the lotions they linger on your skin so it makes perfect to layer your fragrances and so for honorable mention the first one that I have is from skin fix this is the HA BHA body cream this is more for like targeted treatment it is good if you have hyperpigmentation dark spots on your body or you have KP bumps, or you just want your body to feel baby smooth, you use this two to three times a week. It is a body cream, but it has like chemical exfoliants in it. So it's going to leave your body feeling baby smooth. It is going to fade your dark marks on your body. I love this product so much. When you use this and you wake up the next morning, your skin feels so soft and it does a good job if you have KP bumps. It goes hand in hand with a body scrub. If you haven't tried something like this, give this one a try. I recommend this a hundred percent if you want baby smooth skin the next one that i have is newer to my collection this is from the brand pistache skincare this is a pistachio body butter it smells divine it smells divine the formula of this is also very rich very moisturizing if i should compare it to the sol de janeiro body cream i feel like this one is a true pistachio cream the sol de janeiro is like pistachio and everything else but this one is just pistachio and cream it smells beautiful they don't smell similar at all so if you have the Sol de Janeiro, you can still put this one up. Very moisturizing and it goes really well with the Kaoli Yum. I tried this the other day with the Sol de Janeiro body oil and the Kaoli fragrance and y'all smells so good together the first time I used it I paired it with just the Kaoli fragrance and then the other day I tried it with the Kaoli fragrance and the Sol de Janeiro body oil divine you can get this one from amazon you can check out my amazon storefront it, it is worth every single penny this is another one that is not available in canada you guys put me onto this i went ahead and i ordered it from amazon us and it was worth every single penny and if it finishes today i'll repurchase it tomorrow that good <laughs> And the final body cream that I have is another one that is a staple in my routine. This is from Eucerin. This is the Complete Repair Moisturizing Cream. I completely use this up and I already repurchase it. It is just a good everyday, every night kind of moisturizer. It is another one that is very lightweight. I use this the same way that I use the one from Hems, just a one and done when I'm just not in the mood, but I still want to moisturize my skin. This is what I use. It has urea and it has ceramides in it so it's going to maintain smooth soft hydrated skin when you apply this it feels like a lotion and not so much a body cream but trust me your skin is going to feel moisturized and hydrated and super soft 
All right, you guys, so that is it for this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed. As I said before, let me know your favorite body lotions and body creams in the comment section down below. I will have everything linked down below for you guys. I will also link some of my favorite body oils for you guys. But that is it for this video. Once again, don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.